Hey, my name's Ellie Ralph and I'm 17. I grew up in Isworth, it's a little town in London. My biggest hobbies is probably martial arts, also known as karate, but the proper name for it is spirit combat. And it's basically just combines all the elements of karate, so martial arts, um, things like kickboxing and boxing, uh, things like sort of weapon training with nunchucks and meditating. It had a really sort of stereotypical view of it, so I thought, you know, sort of ninja kind of style. When I started karate, I must have been about six. I think people sort of were really sort of delicate with me because I was, they probably thought I was a little fragile. You know, I was a little girl, so I think people tried to take care of me and sort of tiptoe around me a little bit. The way people treat me now in karate has changed. You know, they're not afraid to be a bit rough with me and just treat me like, you know, one of the other guys. Kata is choreographed sort of defence mechanism. It's basically how you defend yourself in a sort of movement. So basically when you do this kind of thing, you're defending someone from your right, and then you do the same thing over that way and you defend someone from your left, and you block and you strike and yeah, it's just movement but you're still defending yourself at the same time. When I'm my black belt, at the moment I'm a shodan belt, which is kind of your second black belt but you go through a process called a grading, which is sort of like a graduation kind of thing. And you go there in a sort of early morning, and then you normally finish sort of late afternoon, and you do form work, meditation, stamina training, which is like sparring with your partner. And towards the end of the day, your sort of graduation part of it, where you earn your certificate and you know get to shake the hand of all the instructors, and then you earn your next belt. Karate has impacted me as a person because it's taught me a lot about discipline how to you know, react to certain situations. It's also taught me a lot about working with other people. Definitely on occasions where I've been angry or upset, I've had to use that sort of thought process, that you know, step back and reevaluate. I'm not sure if I'd be a different person if I didn't do martial arts, but I definitely wouldn't know the people I know were a sort of family. So I'm really grateful that I had the opportunity to start when I did. Now, because of karate, I'd say I'm a, a laid-back person. I don't often get aggressive or feel the need to sort of lash out. I think it's definitely made me a calmer person. Click the videos to watch more Londoners and don't forget to subscribe.